Hello friends, this is Nurbal here for Technique and in this video we will try some of the tips and tricks you can try out on the Nubia Z11 Mini S. So this device comes with Android 6.0 Marshmallow but it has a custom UI. This is the custom UI from Nubia and uh, it comes with a lot of additional features, tools and options. So in this video we will uh, share some of these features which are really useful uh, uh, when using the device. So first step, let's see the notification and quick toggle center. So it has a uh, quick toggles, a lot of them are there. You can also do a bit of customization here. You can uh, switch between different uh, quick toggles, uh, whichever you want. You can just customize it and uh, rearrange them. So that's available in most of the smartphones. Now if you press and hold the home uh, home screen, you can see the option to arrange icons. So if you uh, here, here you can uh, uh, rearrange the icons, just tap on this and you can just uh, rearrange it to other other home, uh, home screen. So it comes with multiple home screens and you can also make a different home screen as uh, your uh, default home screen so that option is available on this uh, device so that's quite a useful option to arrange uh, the icons now coming back uh, uh, to the settings so let's go to the open the settings on this device so here we have a lot of additional options so here you can uh, set the if you select the launcher app so you can see here desktop uh, layout can be changed it can be 4 by 5 or 5 by 5 based on how you want then if you go to the display you have this option uh, for breath light so this is the breath light uh, available at the bottom so you can uh, enable the breath light for uh, charging haptic feedback and do not disturb mode so that can be enabled so that means uh, when you're charging the device the breath light uh, will be available uh, if you have turned it on then uh, you can also uh, see, uh, see set the screen uh, display preferences you can have a, a natural uh, saturation glow saturation and standard saturation and you can also control the screen um, uh, I mean uh, saturation levels uh, it can be either cool or warm so that can be uh, selected from here then uh, we have this option called edge gestures so this is a really useful option so if we just select edge gestures you can see a lot of edge gestures are included hold the edge and swipe inward so that's first gesture uh, so you can uh, see here just you can uh, multitask from here we'll just show you that so we just hold this button and uh, you can see here i can access all the apps so this is one uh, edge gesture then uh, we'll just go back to the other options then uh, we have this swipe uh, down uh, um, uh, swipe up and down from the edge uh, to switch between apps so you can just see here i can just uh, uh, use this edge swiping uh, to access these uh, different apps so that's another gesture and then uh, swipe repeatedly from the gestures so you can uh, see here uh, you can clear the background apps by just swiping here so you can just swipe repeatedly from here to uh, clear background apps then uh, swipe from both edges to increase or decrease the brightness so you can see here i, I can increase or decrease the brightness of the screen uh, using this gesture that's uh, another useful gesture on this device so there is also double click on the edge then uh, apart from that you can also see some of the features included that is uh, so the features include a uh, screen uh, split up uh, custom bottom key touch gesture smart sensing dual instance and super screenshot so a uh, screen split up is you can uh, uh, have uh, two instances of the same i mean a uh, different app so we'll just show you that you can just swipe here and you can see two different instances and one can run uh, calendar so we'll just uh, show you that so now we are running calendar in the top and uh, you can see just running the user manual in the bottom one so this is uh, another useful option you can run uh, two uh, two apps at the same time that's uh, uh, the smart uh, split option so you can just uh, increase or decrease uh, uh, the screen size based on how you want you can just drag and drop uh, to uh, disable altogether then uh, we have custom bottom key so this is a back and uh, i mean this is back and menu button that's a default one you can interchange the back and menu button if you want a different layout for the navigational keys then there are some uh, uh, touch gestures included palm a screen lock try finger screenshot uh, try finger switching app so these are uh, self explanatory apps and then uh, we also have a, a dual instance so you can run uh, two instances of whatsapp or facebook etc since whatsapp is not installed it's not showing up so you can run a uh, dual instances of the app so that's again another useful feature on uh, this device there is also super screenshot option so what it does is uh, when you press and hold uh, the fingerprint scanner we'll just show you 
so you can see the super screenshot option so you can see rectangular circular heart shaped or funny you can have long screenshot and also screen recording so these are some really useful tools because screen recording otherwise you need a third party app but with this uh, you can uh, just uh, record the screen and um, you can just start the screen recording and um, a pretty useful option then there is also free uh, snapshot and long screenshot is also included so it's really a feature rich screenshot option in the nubia z11 mini s so these are some of the uh, options uh, and the tips and tricks you can try out on the nubia z11 mini s so this is a really feature rich ui comes with a lot of additional tools and options including gestures uh, uh, edge gestures uh, super screenshot these are some really useful tools in the device so if you have the device with you you can just try out these options and uh, get the better out of this device so that's all guys with the tips and tricks and uh, options in the nubia z11 mini s hope this video was uh, useful uh, and uh, if you like this video don't uh, forget to hit the like button and also hit the red subscribe button for more videos thanks for watching hope to see you in our next video have a great day